How much do you know about industrial workers? Now that the production of goods is returning to Europe, and the need for a high number of products in lower volumes is rising, their work is becoming more and more challenging. They often have to do difficult tasks that they don't enjoy. To help make things better, we could use the help of robots, but human-robot collaboration still has obstacles to overcome. So, we isolated robots behind fences. But all this takes time and money to be done. But wait! There is one way. If lower costs and helping robotic hands are required, let us introduce... Rossini, Robot Enhanced Sensing, Intelligence and Actuation to Improve Job Quality in Manufacturing. A research and innovation action programme funded by the European Union to develop safe robots by design, increase job quality, achieve production flexibility and productivity. But how will those challenges be addressed? Rossini focuses on human robot understanding tools and technologies. All these tools will be integrated into one platform with seven layers. A sensing layer to scan the scene looking for possible dangers. A perception layer, noting on an image the clear and safe areas. A cognitive layer, the brain making scenarios of what can go wrong and find out the best scenario. A control layer will execute the optimum scenario found out by the brain. An actuation layer to move and stop really fast and accurately move the robot's arms and joints. A human layer to understand the preferences of the human worker. And an integration layer to ensure the safety even in accidents not foreseen. All the layers will be merged into one platform, scalable to more robots to spread the human-robot collaboration. But will it work? The Rossini platform will be demonstrated into three industrial environments. To achieve this, the best team was formed. 13 companies, universities and research centres from seven countries have all come together for one goal. Manufacturing sustainability in Europe and higher job quality with a little robotic help.